This memorial tournament means so much to many people. I know that you personally knew Dave Chapman, played with him. Yeah. When you um, heard the news, what was the one memory that just first popped into your mind? Uh, his giggle. Like it, it, it was always felt good to make him laugh because uh, he was pretty dry, but um, he had a great, cute little giggle, which I liked. He probably stand. found you pretty funny. <laughs> yeah, I think we had uh, similar senses of humor, for sure. So. His style on the court, he was so respected. Everyone has just something else that sticks out to them as far as a player. What in your mind made him such a great player? Well, a lot of things, but he was so competitive and yet he was so fair, which I think shows even more character, you know, because he really wanted to win. It's easy to be fair if you don't give a crap, but he had never cheated ever as far as I've, I've seen. And uh, even one time he got a little too competitive on the court with me and then afterwards he felt so bad he'd text me and apologize and even gave me a room for the next tournament so he was just he had a lot of integrity I think for sure. Do you remember one time that you played him in particular? Yeah. Um, I remember clobbering him in, uh, in uh, Boston which felt good but uh, I shouldn't say that but yeah I remember that. <laughs> I'm sure he loves hearing you giggle on that, you know, in general. Um, coming to the memorial, I know that you've also just seen Ben Manning in the works. He was such a quiet, hard worker. I know we're remembering lots of people here today. And just in general, what does this tournament mean to you? Well, I think of, you know, Dennis Healy, Al Cuevas, um, Mike Ebner, Earl Varner, all these locals that I had relationships with and I really cared about. So, you know, it's nice to keep them in mind. I know you're headed to the semis here. Thanks so much for talking to us. Thank you. Thanks, Sean. Talk to you guys.